looking at the waves of BI and analytics, process mining and RPA, robotic process automation, we think that potential mining will be the next wave. Because, you know, when we look at BI and analytics, um, the question that we want to answer is what can we learn and improve looking at our structured data? Uh, with process mining, we add the visualization of the processes based on this data. And RPA, robotic process automation, adds an automation layer to that to automate like processes or parts of processes. And this is super valid for most of the um, yeah, complicated uh, problems or uh, processes in companies and repeating tasks. Um, but when it comes to complex problems um, where interdependencies are not very clear and where we are in fast changing environment, um, we think that you have to add a kind of predictive layer um, because you cannot just look at the past or at historic data and take a linear um, look into the future because this is the, the problem with complexity and fast changing environments and you have to, to adopt quickly. Um, so this is what we call po potential mining. Um, you have a data layer and on top of that we have a model layer where you have prediction models, um, algorithms, machine learning algorithms. Um, and on top of that, we have an optimization layer. And this optimization layer is key because um, they, the models, they are very um, expensive uh, to, to compute. They are very high dimensional and they, are multi they have to be multi-objective be because reality is always multi-objective. Um, and, um, and so it's very important and, uh, to, to have this optimization layer. And on top of that, you can have um, a visualization layer where you can see your potential, where you can see the trade-offs um, of the, of the uh, question you have to solve. And this is um, based on your data, uh, your potential, and this is what we call potential mining.